Hi guys, welcome to the second exclusive tournament with match point scoring in September. And before this, before we start, Funbridge has uh, some promotion which uh, you can actually use only in September. So what is it good for is actually that if you play a federation tournament in September, any kind of federation tournament, then that one federation tournament will be reimbursed in October. So what does that mean? You get a federation tournament free. How you can use that? Well, for example, play the Czech Bridge Federation tournament, get it reimbursed, so for free you have a chance to actually beat me in the federation tournament and win the reward challenge. So this is something I think worth trying because those diamonds you can spend later on um, well you can use them so absolutely no problem um, in here of course that there are federation tournaments which are more expensive so it really depends which one you choose because uh, the example here shows that if you spend six di 60 diamonds you get 60, 60 diamonds back so well, nice offer uh, from Funbridge, but we are back here with the exclusive tournament and here comes the ranking. So Pavel Wittenbach is leading the field with almost 85% and wow, that's something. But then we have Yusuf second place and Shamin Ivan on the third place with 76%. Wow, congrats Ivan. And what more, we have Lutska. So a friend of mine with 73% here and Sullivan almost that too. Luke standardly being well. So we have only seven players scoring over 70%. But uh, then there are some more players who scored over 65. Kevin we have here. Uh, Paychev Tiger. Um, Bob here scoring almost 7, 67%, so well done Bob, hope to see you soon. And others, so let's go. Let's see if I can get to the top 10 and scoring over 70%. Okay, the first board, we have a balanced hand, but pretty strong on high card points and partner opens, so... This seems to be free no trumps if Pardon is having a weak no trump because our hand is not very good based on extra length tricks establishment. So three, four, five. We might get potentially six tricks based on honors. Still not enough if Pardon doesn't have an interesting hand for us. So let's see what he rebits. Okay, partner bits a no trump, so we just go free no trumps. I think this is kind of no brainer. If there is something else, then it will be pretty lucky. So this should be free no trumps. And here we go. Partner has a minimum hand, so we have two spade tricks, three hard tricks is five, one club trick is six, one diamond trick is seven, and what we want to score is actually three more club tricks which will be 10 and one more diamond trick, which will be 11. So there might be even 12 tricks if we find the spades, <coughs> but 12 tricks will be there only in case that we don't lose the diamond trick because we have to lose the club trick. So because of that, I'm trying the queen here Okay, I guessed it right. This was very important for um, some extra match points. Not to lose this trick, because later on I might get a uh, finesse in spades, maybe possible playing for drop, or even the diamond square spade show up squeeze. So I'm trying to work on the clubs, playing the 10, forcing West to play a doubleton honor. He failed to do so, and he played the 8. So this is something what I'm not happy about actually. Because what can happen now is that if I play a spade and I lose 
and I lose to, sorry, if I play a club and I lose to East, uh, they might cash the diamonds. But diamonds probably split 3-3, free free, so Spade seems to split 3-3 free free too. But there will be only 9. So if I lose one more club and the diamond split 4-4, four four, which actually is possibility because East play the 8 and not the lower one. So there's a chance the diamond split 4-4. Four four. Playing on Spade Finesse, getting 9 tricks, same way as playing the club Finesse, getting uh, a bit more. Eight and a five. Well, this is a clear doubleton. This can't be anything else, guys. This kind, this can't be anything else. Maybe I could have tried to cash everything and and play east actually. So now it's a little bit too late to realize, but maybe I should have cashed the hearts, finesse the spades, and if that works. Cash the spades and East will be kind of squeezed. And I can end play him for the Diamond King and he has to lead from his King Club's doubleton. Ah, uh, well my chance is that they are blocked. But what if Diamonds break free too? Can this guy has four clubs? No, King, eight, five, and a two. But if I win with the king and play the spade, and that actually doesn't work. Then I go down. Yeah, well, I'm going to play the finesse, although I know that it loses. Nine. Oh, uh, uh, come on. No. No, this is not good. The jag is with East. So I misplayed this one. No, it's not. Oof. Okay, so I'm making. Hopefully the spade finesse is off. Hopefully it's off. And I don't lose points and get an average. Oh no, the spade is on. So actually there was kind of a squeeze. Because if I... Cash the three rounds of clubs first, East has to discard twice, and if he does the best, he has to discard the King of Diamonds and one spade. And after I cash three spades, then West might get to the trick. So yeah, there was a there was a way. See that people were making actually ten or eleven tricks. How you make ten, one no trump, three no trumps, and you get a spade lead. Okay, well, that's how. Too bad. So that's the bidding style, which I cannot do anything about. Wow. Okay, so we've got an 8-card suit, but what else? We had a lot of honors. So right now we have 10 tricks from top. And what I want to do actually in here is the 2-diamond opening which is kind of Blackwood uh, with that setup. So if you don't have the two diamond openings strong, then you have to open these two clubs and then try to find out if partner has a bit more. But after opening two diamonds, I will know immediately if partner is having the ace or not. On the other hand, if partner doesn't have the ace, then uh, Partner will be declaring, but I don't think that it matters who is declaring on this board. So let's go. Two spades, partner. Three diamonds, so that's a minor ace. Diamond ace and not a spade ace. So right now I need the queen of clubs or king of diamonds. So I bid three hearts. Let's see what partner does. Okay, if I go four hearts... It's non-forcing. 2021. Wow, I opened forcing to game here. Four no trumps is invitation. So I bid four clubs. Natural bid. Wow. Six no trumps might be a good spot if partner is having the queen of spades. But how can I find out? 
Wow, what to do now? I mean, this is this is the troubling thing. So let's go full clubs. Partner bids four hearts. Now I can ask for something. Blackwood bid asking for kings. Well, I mean, that's fine. Because if partner has the king of diamonds, this is what? Zero or three kings. Wow, still partner had the, ha, can have the queen of spades. He might have the queen of clubs. What can I do? Like five spades. This is what? Natural bid. Six no trumps is a risky bid. Ah! Ah! Yeah. I think six hearts has a little bit extra chance. Mm, yeah, now I need just queen of clubs, queen of diamonds maybe to play a finesse. Queen of spades if they lead a spade. Okay, they lead a spade. Partner has the queen of diamonds and nothing more. Uh, the extra spade is fine, but I might get the club rough, which I cannot get in no trumps. So hopefully the diamond finesse is off. So we're going to rough this one. Catch one round of trumps. Ace and a queen. He played high low, which might be four. Hopefully not six. So the queen is still out there. So hopefully uh, I can manage to get away. Six and a seven. So I think that club split four, four or six, two. Wow. Well, 4-4 four, four is a bit higher chance. Oh, 6-2, well, but well, the queen is... The queen of trumps is with east. So if he has six clubs, two hearts, four dime, four spades... Well, he might have only two spades, actually, so he should have one more diamond. But the spade, well, sorry, guys, the spade is safe. Because we know it's not getting over -roughed. Okay, and the rest. The rest is ours. And the King of Diamonds is on side. But well, they have free space to cash in 6 no trumps. So hopefully, hopefully guys, this will be a good score. 78, 76%. See that two players managed to make 6 no trumps. But probably a couple of them went down. Wow, very interesting board. See how useful it might be to get the Blackwood two diamonds immediately. Then you can ask for kings and then you can pray for one queen out of three queens or a doubleton club as, as it happened to be. 11 high card points, balanced hand. Yes, I have two aces. Uh, three, four, five tricks only. Uh, it's not enough for an opening, I guess. <coughs> We're non vulnerable, but okay. After one spade, now I have a nice hand. I can actually do three spades. I don't play Drury here. Two clubs will be clubs uh, in my setup, so I can invite with three spades, but um, I might just bid four spades. Maybe no Trump. Maybe no Trumps might be better here, so I can actually bid. Wow, two no trumps is without fit. And I don't like this change. Because, well, Arjun expects that I'm playing a jury. But when I have that jury is not on, the two no trumps should be the same as what is my setup without uh, opening on the third or fourth seed. So because of that... I can be out of three spades. Which is invitation with fit. I might lie that I have a four card fit. Well, they say five card fit. Or I might just go four spades. Yeah, I will invite. I will invite. I don't know if Queen Jack 10 is worth anything. So let's give Pardon a chance. So Arjun doesn't feel that she's not there because of nothing. 
Okay, uh, club loser. So playing trumps, we are thinking losers from the north side. No diamond loser, one club loser. Potentially no hard loser if the finesse is on. Uh, no spade loser if the finesse is on. So we might discard the club on the heart if all the finesses are on and heart split free free. Well, that's why you don't want to duck. Playing the trumps first seems to be the best here. Although I need, I kind of need entries for making all 13 tricks. So maybe I have to play the queen of hearts first. But if they are smart, they see the queen jack 10, they are not covering the first two. So I don't want to risk that something happens later on and they rough me, they rough me hard. Okay, so that works. And now I can try that. Now I actually have to try that. Okay, that didn't work out. Oh, and they didn't catch the diamonds. Wow, that was a gift. Did he add a singleton club or he didn't know what what what's that? Because now I have the communication and my hearts are good. Interesting. So I got a gift. Probably everybody who are in the top got the same gift. Because without these kind of gifts you cannot win this tournament. Or you cannot be in the top 10. See, obviously, he didn't know what his partner is holding in clubs. And he was afraid to give away the trick with Queen Jack. That he might have been thinking that the King-10 is in North. Wow. 74%. So a lot of Argins just play that. Just very few. Only like half of the players scored uh, 11 tricks. Well, there were some people who scored only 10 tricks. And that's, that's very hurtful to their score. Okay, one diamond, one no trump. So opponents have like half of the points. I have 10. So partners still can have something like 8. But with this distribution, I don't want to get invulnerable. So this is more about defending and finding the right lead. It might be the spade, but if you lead the spade, it can actually split four triple three with West having um, having four. So we might help opponents. Barton didn't overcall, so it's not very likely that he has a good five card. So we cannot catch five spade five spade tricks straight. So it's a club lead or a hard lead, but East promised clubs, so although it might be risky to lead from King Jack, I'm going to lead a heart. Queen, okay, so that worked, and the dummy is having four spades and only three aces. Partner will have four hearts because the shift back with the lowest card is actually from length. So originally from four. If Arjun will play a higher card, so we will still see the lower one. Uh, that would be actually from uh, three. So I might want to unblock here because I want partner to play me the spade or I want partner to play me the club. Yeah, so it's not diamonds. That's what we know. And it's partner's choice which one he wants to play. There are two discards of clubs. So obviously it seems to be like five clubs. Two hearts and free free. Well this works. This this is working pretty well. So so far two tricks. I get the club king. I might cash the spades. Partner still might have four spades, actually. Nope. But he should have the jack. Okay. And the ace of clubs, I guess, two? No. Still, we have beaten the contract once. 
and I think that's fine. Maybe if we work on clubs and not on spades, that would have been better. Queen and a 10. See that the spade lead is disaster because we actually give away uh, the tempo for establishing the extra spade trick. Oh, 92% for this play to being bold and lead a small heart. Who is this lucky guy? Oh, Joao Fania from Portugal, a friend of mine, top player. He led the heart and he found the switch, same unblock. Okay, Arjun played the club here, not the diamond. So this is something which actually is worth now they can establish the spades and get even the club trick and he discarded the diamond so he tries oh god and now he tries the club club finesse and they got a communication to catch the diamond seven so not only a top score but a beer card in the defense so congrats joel Nice defense uh, by north-south. Okay, and a garbage hand, so we just pass, and we'll be defending again. Diamond heart, two no trumps, shows 18-19 balanced. Four no trumps should be actually invitation, so something like 15 high card points, exactly 14. So that's how Argent plays with 32-33. Five diamonds as a natural bid so I guess that they end up in six diamonds no it is six no it is six no and it's my lead oh and my, this might be tough so East will have like five three three two so which doubleton it might be he might have it might be the club lead uh, the jack might be interesting, but the jack might give away a trick if there is a 4-9 with West. So it might be a low club. It might be a top spade. I don't want to lead a singleton jack of diamonds, because partner will probably have four diamonds. Very tricky decision. East actually doesn't have four spades, so I think the spade lead seems to be safest here. Because if Barton has an honor, the finesse will be on anyway. I might miss finessing the clubs, but see that 4-4, that it will be a four card in clubs. Come on, show us, Arjun. Show us! Here we go, see, clubs, and we got the spade trick from the lead. What is exactly 14? So we have four points and partner has the king, which is actually seven. So if they have 32, 33, partner has nothing, maximum jack of hearts. And I think I might be squeezed, but if north is actually holding up, with four rounds of diamonds, with the fourth ten, and Arjun doesn't finesse that, Arjun doesn't guess it, uh, she will be short on tricks, so I might get the queen of hearts because he, she will play the small heart towards the jack. Okay, well, I'm not sure if this was the best switch. The club would be probably the best. So on diamonds I have the spade discards and a heart. What do I want to discard? A low heart? Yeah, I guess a low heart. Low heart might go first. What's going on with the connection here? Maybe I need to restart. Okay, I'm going to restart, guys. So let's. Okay, here we go. So this is a bad sign. 
it has the 10 so I'm going to discard the heart now I'm going to I'm, I'm squeezed guys I'm squeezed so and I know that I'm squeezed well the rest are didn't ha didn't work out why because I need to discard twice so if I discard two spades and then he cashes two spades then I'm done Ace of clubs, crossing with the spades, oh no, cashing the king of hearts is actually giving it away for me. So my chance is that Parn is having third jack. Wow. Club to the ace. No, club king actually. No, not a heart. Partner. No, partner squeezed. Wow, we got both squeezed. Ah, this will be a zero. Wow, this will be a zero. Well played, Arjun. There was a double squeeze there. Six no trumps doubled. So that many people. So this actually costed me. See, I had to be there among the 82 players to actually get a chance uh, to be in the top three. This is, this is already too late. But I don't think that I could have done anything. Leading the club, maybe... But Arjun can play the same way. Uh, that was just really well played to squeeze both of us. So first North was squeezed with the 10 of Diamonds and 10 of Hearts Doubleton. And then I was squeezing Hearts and Clubs. Wow, well done. One spade double three spades. That should be preemptive but vulnerable. I might get two tricks. Partner with the double should get free tricks. So I don't think that they are making free spades. We don't have anything, but if I double that would be takeout. So I have to pass. If partner bit second double, I pass. Wow, well, maybe I might bit free no trumps. I'll not score the spade jack. Wow, so this is tough, guys. This is tough. I have, like, nothing. So I need partners to score three tricks and hope that I score two. If this goes two down, three no trumps is no, no good. But I might get, actually, two stoppers there. So if I get four hard tricks, four diamond tricks, and a spade, or something like that, or four hard tricks... Three diamond tricks and a club and a spade. Three no trumps might be there. So the question is, is three spades going down? And if, is it going down once or twice? That's the question. The king, queen and spades might be there. There will be like one owner. If that's a spade owner, there might be no other owner. So there might be no entry if I will be playing no trumps. But there will be roughing potential probably. I guess in diamonds to finish my jack of spades. So this is what is match points about. Yeah, well, I don't have a good feeling about passing here. It might really go badly because North is leading. If he has like finesses, I'm betting free no trumps. So let's go. Top score. Wow, partner has a king. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, so what are my chances? So obviously I need West to get to the trick. I might get five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
Ace of Diamonds, King of Diamonds, Diamond. So I get West hopefully to the trick. If he leads a spade, then I get the clubs. Four, five, six, seven, eight. So I might as well play the Queen of Clubs because I don't have the entries. There are four spades there. So let's try one round of diamonds to see what's actually the situation there. So ace, six and a seven. That's bad because I'm missing still four and a three. So one guy will have a doubleton with seven two or seven three and the other one will have queen jack fourth. So this is not what I want to play here. I might play the ace of clubs, queen of clubs, just in case the king of clubs drops singleton. Or I might just play a heart. Or I might just play a heart. There might be ace king there. If this guy is having five spades and four diamonds, see that's the problematic thing. Because if West is having five hearts and sorry, five spades and four diamonds, that means that King of Clubs might be doubleton or is very likely doubleton. So they lose two spades, they lose two diamonds, and they lose a club. Minimum one club. So actually passing three would be a good thing. Probably three spades doubled. It can go for 500. So I need them to have a singleton club. And a singleton king with west. Eight. Ha! Ha! Guys. Isn't that smart? Isn't that smart? This is the match point how it is played, but what now? Okay, so now we know that West is having three hearts, five spades, four diamonds, singleton club. So I have three club tricks, two diamond tricks is five, two spade tricks is seven. I can establish the heart. I don't want to play a club there. I can establish a club, but what then? I probably need to play hard and hope that West gets to the trick. I can lose three hard tricks and a diamond trick there. I'm going to do that. Small, okay, so that's good. So we might actually end play West. He might give us this trick. Oh god, what's ho what's going on? So he's having 5-5. Five, five. It's not good. This was not good. Ah. Who would have think that he has 5 hearts and 5 clubs? Sorry, 5 spades and 5 hearts. I mean, and he has a second diamond to escape. Oh God! Wow, and the Queen of Spades is on side, guys. I could have easily made. I could have easily made. Yeah. Wow. And well, they lose 500 there. Okay, I misguessed. Ah, uh, guys, I misguessed. Freedom. So this costed me a lot. Who would have think about that? Five hearts, ace king jack, and I play a heart and give him not even playing the queen. If I play the queen, they have only three hearts, but then still I don't have an entry. 
So definitely I could have made free no trumps here if I know the cards. Because you just cash the king of diamonds and exit with the heart. Well, it's not that help. It's not helping that much. You need to exit with the heart, get the trick, and then end play east. Well, probably tough. There were 44 players who made, but see that passing free space is going down for 500. Yeah. Well, this was a tough decision board. This was a really tough decision board. Okay, guys, I need to hurry a little bit. 12 high card points with a club. Okay, well, this is when you hurry. This is how you do. You just pass out one club, partner. When we have a 9 card fit in spades. So, obviously, this is no good. This is no good. Wow, we have a nine card fit in spades, eight card fit in hearts. Uh, spade draft, no. Okay, well, can we just draw one round, one more, one more round? Oh, well, they're annoying. Okay, I, I get two tricks. Well, that's fair. That's only 500 if they have 600. But I don't think that's good. 51%. So a lot of players had the same. Free no trumps is actually not there. Oh, so interesting. Okay, well, this these are languages I can't really guys need. Pass one club with five spades and four hearts. Yeah, well, this is tough, obviously. If you have nothing, um, yeah, well, you just have to pass. If you are not playing transfers after a club, then you cannot just bid, because then you will play a little bit higher. With 13 high card points, forcing to game here, ending up in no trumps, I guess. I'll get the hard lead right now. I want to give partner a chance. Because if partner is having 5-5 five, five in spades and diamonds, that would actually be kind of 5 losers and I'm covering 4 of them. So, guys, this can be 6 diamonds. Even on a 4 free fit. But then I need extras, so that's life. 5-4, so this is a singleton, they found the lead. Um, so the good thing is that it's not 6 diamonds. 4th best. So do I want to duck one? 5, 9, 10, possibly 11. Um, okay, I dug one round, not more, because this is queen jack 10, I have to dug this one, and now do I cash the spades or do I play the heart, 4, I have to do that guys, I have to do that. But heart split for two, so actually there might be a doubleton queen dropping with west in hearts. What would that mean exactly? He's already discarding that I have all the heart tricks. And I will make ten tricks. Yeah, I will. Finexing doubleton queen. Well, didn't need it to do that, but I'm glad I did. So actually, this 
tournament was really interesting, but you needed first, first what you needed was the six no trumps that Arjun misplaced. And this was a club lead great, so I don't get a good score because uh, I might establish an extra diamond trick here. 70%, wow, it's quite a lot, I would expect less. Well, I guess the heart, but still, I would expect less. See, if I don't get the club lead, I will probably have 95. So at the end, 57.8. Uh, I'm really not happy because, well, it's about the 6 no trumps, but more importantly, it's the decision here if I pass 3 no trumps or not. Because if I, sorry, if I pass 3 spades or bit 3 no trumps, this will be a 72%, which is 8 more percent. Uh, in total, so I will have like 65.8 and this one, this one actually, see the difference is another 40, so another 5%. So these two boards uh, will get me over 70% and for the rest, I mean, I couldn't do, I couldn't do much there. So I'm quite happy. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed and of course, always on first day there is a live stream. Uh, if you want, once again, to get a free tournament uh, in September, just go Federation Tournaments. You can choose any, but of course, that if you want to win an extra challenge, a reward challenge against me, you might choose the Czech Federation Tournament. And even if you don't want uh, that, then actually you see that it's just only 20 diamonds to play and uh, you have a fair chance to be the best foreign player in that tournament to win the reward challenge against me. Normally we have over 20, 20 players with 16 boards, I'm scoring, everybody are playing the same boards and that's important. Why? Because uh, it's a fair game, it's a fair game. Of course we, uh, we are sure that people play fair and straight because Besides the match points, there are no like huge prizes. And if you want to win the challenge against me, it's the pride and the glory. So take care and stay safe, guys.